today we are playing Aborian. Um, we do have one more of the old recordings with Tub uh, with World of Tanks, but for today we are going to be playing Aborian. Uh, still in the same sector as last time, nothing's really changed. I'm going to kind of sit around here, hope a couple more fights break out, see if I can get some... Oh shit. <laughs> see if I can misclick and immediately get damaged. Ooh, let's boost out of here. Alright, I'm not going to wait in this sector anymore. <laughs> well, that uh, solved it. Let's go ahead and jump onto another one. Uh, That one there. I was going to stay in this sector and mine out some of these resources and stuff once these guys eventually dropped a mining turret for me to use. But... Unfortunately, that's just not going to happen. So, we're going to go ahead and jump out of the sector. Yeah, they like one shot a part of my ship off. That was fun. That was very fun. So, uh, I've got a timer going on now. Oh, we're in a salvage sector. Another sector I'm not really going to be able to do much in. Lovely. Um, anyway... Yeah, this is salvaging. I wonder if they sell salvaging weapons. They don't. Well. Okay, sorry about that. Um, what we need to do is we need to mine some more uh, neonite and trinium. So we can upgrade our ship one more time here. There's something moving behind me. Something in exit build mode. I haven't played this in a little bit. Again, it's been like two weeks since the last time I played. There it is. Neat. Uh, so it's been a little bit since I played. Not much I could say other than that. We need some mining weapons. Uh, shit. <laughs> there are available objects in this sector, and that's one of them there. But I need to get away from these pirates. I wish I can get within like one kilometer of this instead of 0 0.20 kilometers. It'd make it so much easier. There we go. Bit of a deal of money though. I don't know if there's any more things in the sector, but I really don't want to stick around too much longer. Uh, is there a green spot near me? We'll head up here. I know there's probably going to be some form of hidden stash or something in the sector. I see there's a beacon. But we're going to be skipping it. <laughs> Yay, a friendly sector. Yep, we have, we're in good relations with these guys. Uh, high pressure to factory XXL. Is there like any other stuff here? Equipment dock, perhaps? Nope, wouldn't be so lucky. There is a gate costing 488, leading back to where we just came, but it might lead to an equipment dock, so we're gonna head through that gate. Let's see if we can get an equipment dock that'll sell us a mining turret of some form. Maybe of trinium, who knows. And we come into, I'm gonna guess this is an empty sector, completely empty sector, lovely. This next one, 242. We're going back the opposite direction we need to go, but fingers crossed we might just be able to get a. Um... We need to head that way a little bit. There we go. Fingers crossed we'll be able to get a uh, uh, mining turret. Anyway, I'll be back when I find something somewhat useful or interesting or something. Just as I jump out of another sector here, uh, been three jumps, the other two were empty sectors essentially, 
Uh, we come into this neutral zone, which means no combat, pretty much. Might as well turn off everything. Uh, and it's got a really big, highly stocked uh, resource depot. And aside from that, I did see, I gotta zoom out now, a trade depot and a repair bay. But, again, no equipment dock, unless it's far out there. So that sucks. I have to remember this is a neutral zone, and I didn't recall seeing a little notifier saying that there's a valuable objects here, so let's take that off. Put that back on, and there isn't. So we'll head off to the next sector, which is here, I guess. Which I'm only assuming is that gate northwest, yeah. the issue with advancing too far too quickly is because then you don't have the mining or equipment or the equipment necessary to actually progress and you're way weaker than everybody else good news is that we're relatively light and move rather quickly so what's going on here four way intersection we might want to head up to the northmost gate northwest or north west northwest there is there anything else here? Not really. Uh, this one here is the northwest, southwest, north, northeast. So the north, northeast is one I want to go to. Uh, again, I'll be back when I find something interesting. It's gonna be one of those episodes, I suppose, for just roaming throughout station or sectors. Okay, so we've come into a sector with a shipyard. I see. But aside from that, uh, there's also valuable objects in the sector somewhere hidden. Uh, I see a large asteroid out that direction, I think. Yeah. Uh, aside from that, is it only a shipyard here? Shipyard and repair bay. Lovely. It's just absolutely refusing to give me a uh, <laughs> equipment dock. We've jumped through a couple jumps here now. Uh, no equipment dock. So, well, uh, we are going to head up this way a little ways, find valuable, obje valuable objects in the sector, and then jump to the next one, I guess. Next episode, hopefully, hopefully this episode will find a mining laser. Next episode, hopefully, I'll be able to start building a, a ship. They're upgrading this ship, I should say. It's pretty much just been one episode build, one episode upgrade, or one episode explore couple of episodes explore stuff like that but anyway be back in a little bit I suppose while still absolutely nothing has I have not still found anything as far as useful objects or uh, the station I need a group of aliens jumped into this sector we've kind of roamed about a bit I'll see what these aliens drop from the local oops from the, uh, there we go. I'll see what these aliens drop when these guys attack them, but aside from that, not a whole lot I can really do. Need to find the, uh, things over there. Shooting a lot of stuff. Neat. Anyway, I'll be back in a bit. So, other than this being really loud, I had a strange idea. What if I just started destroying some of these blocks on these ships? Um... Let's see if they'll drop equipment that way. I did have it there. They did kill one of these ships here a second ago. It's getting really loud already again. <laughs> well, they dropped something, but it looks like a tech. Two techs. One of them is, ooh, cool. It also highlights the objects. That's useful. Anyway, let's see if destroying this will do anything. I'll be back if anything, I find anything. 
Well, I got a green tech out of it. Thus far, anyway. I'm not really getting anything much else, just a sensor upgrade. But I'll keep at it, see what I can get. I picked up a trinium chain gun. So, there's something. Not a mining turret, though. Ooh. This is uh, some interesting stuff here. We got a good turret controller and another lightning turret. Darn it. <laughs> I was hoping that would be a yellow um, yellow mining turret. That's nice. Still, though, stuff to put on. Uh, I think they were, I think it was trinium. Yep, a trinium one, so it should be decent. Well, I'm not getting much else here from this and all the other bits are tiny little pieces like that, so. Uh, yep. There we go. They just, I do like how they just kind of spin off into space doing that kind of weird motion. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and head off where I have selected. See what's out that way. See a large trinium asteroid. Or a pair bay. But yet again, no goddamn equipment dock. <laughs> this is gonna be the name for this, is that I can't find any equipment dock anywhere, apparently. I figure if we find an equipment dock, I might as well just put a small hangar on this thing and just get some uh some uh, mining drones. Or mining fighters. I gotta get pilots for that though. I think it's uh, a pilot or two per fighter, so. Anyway, let's keep it going. See what we find. Not crash into a warp gate. The most useful sector I have ever found. Literally. There's nothing here. Ah. Uh. This is gonna take a little while, I'm gonna guess. I don't know, I, I'm gonna go ahead. I wonder actually here, hold on. I might need to make a temporary addition here to the craft. This here. Oh, wow, that, a 2.5 sector, sector radius and I don't even have enough for that. Not even to make it really tiny. One point three. Okay. We're not adding any extra sector jump ranges to the ship for a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and jump out of here. But it might be just quicker just to do this. Cost a little bit more, but oh well. Uh be back in a little bit. <laughs> well, we're back in the uh, sector for salvaging. And uh, we came across some pirates. I was gonna go up here north uh, west. They're coming right for me, aren't they? No? Yeah? Maybe? My phone's deciding to Google things for me, even though I don't want it to. Plus, it likes to pick up what I'm talking for some strange reason. Anyway, I'm gonna see what happens here if I don't get shot up too much. And, uh,. Come back and see what I can get from it. Right, I pretty much got absolutely nothing. Uh, so, yeah. Don't know what to say. Anyway, there's some small things that jumped in the sector. Uh, I forget what they're called now off the top of my head. The aliens. Uh, I'm gonna jump out of the sector. Head through the north gate. North gate. North gate. That one. Anyway, uh, once they get destroyed, they count as normal ships, so. Uh, or normal salvage, so the sector is yelling at me saying, You can't salvage these here! <laughs> anyway. Not without a salvage license, anyway. And yet another salvage sector. God damn it. It's all these salvage sectors. 
head through this gate here as well, I guess. West, so that's the opposite direction they need to be heading. But I'll go there if it thinks that there if I think there might be a freaking <laughs> equipment dock. This this is like the longest stretch I've gone without seeing a single equipment dock. But Yeah well, back in a bit. Found a turret factory, but still no equipment dock. Yeah. Not only did I find yet another completely empty sector, but on top of that, it aims straight down back this way. Uh, Alright, this is going to take a long time to find the equipment dock, apparently. So, back as soon as I do. Or find something interesting, of course. We're going to have to end the episode before we can get an uh, equipment dock. Anyway. Holy cow! That took forever. So, after so long of eventually going everywhere, and it's this weird loop-de-loop -loop kind of thing, we found an equipment dock. Watch it sell nothing. Laser turret, repair turret, plasma turret. There's a salvaging turret that's nanite. There is a trinium mining turret for 44,000. And there's three of them, actually. So I'll get up there, we'll buy those. And we'll start mining some stuff. And of course, the sector's under attack by another faction, and it's being attacked by pirates. Wow, this sector is just unlucky. Oh, and there's a research, uh, uh, whatever the thing is, uh, that bay. Okay. Alright, once I get all this sorted out here, I will be right back. Okay, so we finally got our equipment dock and stuff. Uh, I went ahead and upgraded some of our stuff in the research bay here. Getting some frame lag, skip stuff here. Uh, I salvaged what I could from that battle. We now have, uh, let's see here, some lightning turrets and a Tesla turret and a plasma turret. Uh, all trinium quality. We have a chain gun, which is trinium. These, which are trinium. And I think one of them is neonite. And then we have our three neon or trinium uh, mining turrets. That's right. Uh, we don't have enough turrets for our ship. Uh, anyway, so between episodes, what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue to upgrade our stuff, get more things. And next episode, I plan to upgrade our ship, give it hopefully trinium armor and maybe uh, a decent hangar would be nice these things would be nice uh, it might require a total remake of the ship not like a like I get rid of all the inside and then rebuild all the inside we'll have to find out uh, next episode so the entire next episode might just be me building a lot between episodes I do plan to get a lot of resources and maybe fill up our weapon slots and stuff here. So we'll see how that goes. I would like to keep the basic layout of the ship the way it is, but uh, in order to get some of the interior stuff upgraded, I might have to cut open the hull and stuff to actually do that. Um, so we got a few, quite a few items here from our upgrading a research bay. We did get that uh, red exotic turret control system during one of the fights that we picked up this episode, as well as this exceptional object detector. That we got during the upgrading here at the research station, which is a pretty nice radar. Means we can see a lot further. Another thing I want is a improved, um, or actually just a, <laughs> a hyperspace core. And definitely something with shielding. Definitely need shields. So those things would be nice. As well as an increased power generation, which we currently don't have a very lot a whole lot of. Uh let's see, this is the button I was looking for. So I wanted to see they've got crew quarters. What was I looking? So I definitely want a hangar, which I think the lowest you can get is trinium. Yep. Um 
shield generator of course and energy containers and stuff and just general upgrades that way a computer core which will allow us to get more slots for items but if I recall correctly you need a decent sized one and they're re really rather expensive in order to do this see we're not even getting a free one for that I don't think there you go that gives us one one free system upgrade slot and that might just be because we're adding enough for enough space to get it I don't know um, let's see what else we have here we can upgrade of course we do want the hyperspace core to inc increase our jump range aside from that I think that's pretty much it we'll try to get some tritium armor going on and my audio just cut out that was strange oh well and eventually we'll go to Zanian and then to Hog Knight and Hog Knight. Yeah. That's the heavy armor, if I recall correctly. It's heavier than iron, but it has a lot more durability. And then we have the Havorian, which is the best of the best, I guess. Well, I think the Hog Knight armor might be better. I don't know. Let's see. Where's it at here? Actually, does Zavorian even have armor blocks? It does not look like it does. Yep. So. That'll be the plan for the next episode, is just to build a lot I'll mine in between episodes. Uh, we, play we paid the Comet's insurance twice now, and <laughs> we have also paid our crew just a little bit ago, so I don't know how long it is till the next crew payment. Probably not 164 minutes, so quite a while. Uh, we're going to need more crew just simply for the weapons and stuff that we're going to add onto our ship and the uh, extra engineers, of course, and stuff. But this is a good place to end this episode. Thank you all for watching. It's been a very uneventful episode because we've been looking for a freaking equipment dock the entire time. But aside from that, I'll see you all next time.